Eclipse mania has taken over the tri-state. What to know about Monday's phenomenon? Join us as we embark on an awe-inspiring journey through the celestial wonder of the total solar eclipse. Today, we're diving into the captivating phenomenon that has the tri-state area and beyond buzzing with excitement. Get ready to witness nature's breathtaking spectacle like never before. New York City will see 89% coverage during the solar eclipse, with 96% in the capital region and total coverage in upstate New York in areas including Buffalo and Rochester. What to know? On Monday, April 8, 2024, a total solar eclipse will occur as the moon moves in front of the sun, blocking the sun from view either totally or partially for most of the United States. While the New York City area is not in the path of totality, city residents will see a partial eclipse. Areas of upstate New York, including Buffalo, Rochester and Plattsburgh, will be in the path of totality for up to four minutes. We are mere hours away from one of the most exciting celestial events, a total solar eclipse. During a total solar eclipse, the moon passes in front of the sun, blocking at least part of it from view. The last total solar eclipse was on August 21, 2017. While the New York City area is not in the path of totality, city residents will see a partial eclipse, which will start just after 2 p.m. on Monday. When will the solar eclipse occur and where? During the afternoon of April 8, 2024, a total eclipse will encompass the western and northern parts of New York State. In less than 15 minutes within a 3.15 p.m. to 3.30 p.m. window, the moon will pass between the Earth and Sun, turning day into night for one and a half minutes to three and a half minutes. The roughly 100-mile-wide path of totality will enter in the southwestern part of the state just after 3.15 p.m. and will depart northern New York just before 3.30 p.m. Cities and towns within this path include Jamestown, Buffalo, Rochester, Syracuse, Watertown, Old Forge, Lake Placid and Plattsburgh. The entire event will last for up to two and a half hours, marking the time the sun is first obstructed to the last moments when the moon's shadow is cast. For other areas of the state that are outside the path, there will still be quite a celestial spectacle. The minimum coverage in the state will be on Long Island, with the sun being shadowed at 88% there. New York City will see 89% coverage, with 96% in the capital region. New York City will see a partial eclipse beginning around 2 p.m. and peaking around 3 to 25 p.m., according to Storm Team 4. The partial eclipse is expected to end in NYC around 4.36 p.m. Where can I get free eclipse glasses? During the eclipse, it is especially unsafe to look directly at the sun without specialized eye protection, which can result in serious injury. The partial phases of the solar eclipse can only be safely observed directly with specialized eclipse glasses or a handheld solar viewer. Regular sunglasses are not a safe replacement. A limited quantity of I Love NY Eclipse glasses will be available at locations throughout the state, including New York State Welcome Centers and select service areas along the New York State Thruway, at the Apple Green Sea stores. As we bid adieu to this mesmerizing journey through the celestial wonder of the total solar eclipse, remember to keep looking up at the stars and marveling at the mysteries of the universe. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring the wonders of our cosmos.